Alright guys, I'm back again, and before I'm gonna play, I just want to rec uh, to tell you, if you hear any uh, annoying noise in the background, like a fan, like a fan, then it is true, it is my computer, which is rendering part number 14, while I'm gonna play part number 16. And I think I got what I really needed to get her, I think I got all the minimize in this area here. Well, there's one more to go, actually. And yeah, that one is hidden below this block or boulder. Just around the corner. And it should be the one at the bottom. There we go. And that's about it. There's nothing much to it, actually. And now, if you go to this Hyrule world, it will be one more at the same spot as in Lure. Hmm. And in the link to the past, that's a way actually there. There's like an entrance or a hidden a hidden uh, staircase. Not here, but the one at the bottom though. I think it is. Where we can get some rupees. Quite a lot of them. And the maximum you can get in A Link to the Past, I think it is 999 rupees. While in uh, A Link Between Worlds there are 9999 rupees. And I also think I forgot to save a Maya Maya here, didn't I? Yeah, there's one here at the bottom in the water. You see it? Yeah, that's where it is. Let's go in and see what's been inside here. Could there be anything of interest? This uh, is actually known as the uh, Swarm Palace in um, in uh, the game when you go to the world. Oops. Oh, I actually went backwards. I didn't intend to do so. First of all, you just see a cutscene of uh, where that chest is hidden. Alright, yeah, you have to go... There we go, we got one switch. You cannot get that one yet. Now let's see if I do recall this. Now the water will rise all over again. And... Now, just let me have a look. Um, there we got another switch hit. Mm, we got to hit it, yay. And you have to go and swim a bit. You have to go for a bath. If you really want to get some rupees, there are 10 rupees just here alone, waiting for you. But I don't bother about them. But what I bother is about getting this floor to fall down. Yep. There we go. And now, let's see, yeah. Oh, you cannot do it this way as I thought you could. Oh, yeah, yeah, of course, of course. My bad. Hit the switch. And the water will once again rise, and this will be the last time. Now use the hookshot to get our... And, of course, yeah, we have to hit besides that chest. You can open the chest from the sides or the back. You don't have to be in front of it. And we already got one more hundred rupees for a short little puzzle. That's a good way to end it, in my opinion that is. Just have to kill that little bird. And talking about the birds in Lurul, I forgot actually to look up the names, but I think it's been called Vulture or something. Well, there's one type of specific bird thing, yeah, like that is named Vulture. And I think that's those so many different names so you might forget them. That's usually what I do. 
so what we're gonna do now, we are going for another uh, race, which is also in uh, uh, a link between uh, in uh, into the past, a link in the past. <laughs> no, a link to the past. Gosh. And I'm not going for saying the Maya Maris at the moment, as you probably have understood. But we got 52 of them, so I can upgrade one more item if I like to. But at the moment it is not that important to me, though. Then I think it is more important to upgrade the sword. And therefore we are going to a place we know about in A Link to the Past, which also is going to be hell. And yeah, I forgot about this Maya Maya here. And let's see what's being in here. We have a lot of rocks we can lift, or boulders, big ones. Oh yeah, they are just being fearless there. I didn't even recall that. So if we go to the blacksmith area, there is another big boulder waiting for us. Let's go and lift it. And there is the mother of Gully. And she's there. I'm still so terrible worried about my little gully Megator. What did you say? Oh, that's good. I'm so relieved. Blah, 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 blah. And here we got another piece of a heart. And we can go more southwards and save uh, another Maya Maya, I know. I think actually, if I... Oh, so Gales. Oh, isn't there anyone closer than you? Ouch. Well, this might just work. I know Irene will be thanking you for saving her, which we did in the previous video. When we touched that painting. And I know there is a Maya Maya nearby, below a rock. Just wait for the Soros to not hit you. And I think the versions in the world have been called uh, Q or something like that. Oh wait, no, am I? Is my memory messing me up? Isn't there a boulder? Yeah, there it is. Good. So let's go here. Let's save this Maya Maya, which will be number 54, was it? Yeah, number 54. And if you hear when I'm hitting any other places on the rock, there are no noises, but there is one spot. Let's go and see what's inside here. In A Link to the Past, we could find the Ice Ward here. And now we got 300 rupees. So, I was about that zero rupees a little while ago, and now we got over 1500 rupees. There's some difference. I almost can buy two more items if I like to. Uh, my friends, that should be everything. For now. I think I actually saved all the Maya Mayas in this area, didn't I? Yeah, I did. That's awesome. And um, up to here, I saved every single one of them. Which is quite good. And if we go into uh, low rule from here, you can actually be accessing uh, another dungeon. I'm actually not going to take this dungeon yet, but we can go and get some goodies if we like to. Uh, 
I think there's also a Maya Maya here as well. Or isn't it? Hmm. I thought there was one there. And this is a story? So, oh, you take two hits. Okay. And I think this is a big fairy here. No, that's just like small ones. Okay, good. So actually before we are going any further, I'm going to get some other goodies. I'm just going to open the path to another dungeon, which we are not going to go into yet, but we're going to get some Maya Mayas. Oh, stupid crap. Oh, I thought I had you there for a moment. Oh, uh, it's kind of like burning or something. Kind of, yeah, sort of. And there are no Maya Mayas for me to pick up in the water, are right there? I just don't want to be quite sure before I go anywhere else. Oh. Yeah, there is one there, of course. I forgot about you. And I think you have to... No, why do you do that? <laughs> Stupid me. I just have to go back. The way to save it is going back up the same. And we are going to the left. There we got it. Now we got you. And there are three more to find. And I know definitely about one of them. I think these guys were called Q or something. K K U. Uh, in Norwegian, that means cove. So that's an interesting name for me. That is. And here you got a big uh, mama turtle. Oh no, I got separated from my little turtles. You have to help me look for them. You just have to. Uh, by saving them, you will make your way to Turtle Rock. So let's go and save some turtles and Maya Maya. There we got another Maya Maya, which is the one I mentioned I knew where it was hidden. Oh, you almost hit me now. And we should be close to one of these small turtles, turtle babies. What you have to do is just to lift it, but I'm just gonna kill those land crab things. And it will thank you for helping uh, rescuing it. There we got another Maya Maya. And there is one turtle which is getting spit on by all this Q. And it will thank you for saving it. It was so scary. Poor turtle. And now, the most hid well hidden one so far. This one is kind of fun to save. You actually have to climb to make it being saved. Make it fall into the water. And now, you got yourself a little right. <laughs> Thank you. 
So actually, I'm just going across there. And we're gonna add this rain for later on. So, you know, I'm quite close to another dungeon. And, uh, yeah. There's supposed to be one more Maya Maya in this area. If I just could remember. There you are. Up there. Of course. I'll see a me to forget about you. No, I think those big ones are called something on the V. Not too long, was though. <laughs> there we go. That's the last Maya Maya in this area of uh, Lou World. So we got them saved in two spots. So I mean, like two different places, though. And um, yeah. Then we got another chest. Keeping 100 rupees for us. Or holding 100 rupees though. And it seems like I'm getting close to the end of this video, so we're gonna open the way to the next dungeon which I'm going through. I'm not going through this one yet. There's one more which I just want to open the way for. I'll open the way to So I'm just going to the thieves town. Alright, I win sexy here. That would be 9999 rupees. I'm just messing with you. Blah blah blah. <laughs> That's the maximum you can get in this game is 9999 rupees. And there we go. That's how we get back to this world, which has been called High Rule. We're going back to Hyrule. Yep. And now we will get another recovery heart if you need that one. But you have to get it anyway. You have to pick it up. <laughs> and we are into Kakariko Village. And we just quit the thieves town. Yay! So where do you want to go? Okay, I surely want to go up here because there's some Maya Maya we have to rescue. And that makes it been just two more to save in this area. Let's see if we can find them. I just might be editing out just to show you where you find them. We got one just below that right stuff, uh, right uh, stone there, and we're going to find the next one. And I think it's just going to be a bit more to the right, huh? Because it will be on the entrance to um, to Death Mountain. Oh, five more rupees. That's good. So just kill this mini drum and go right forward. Go outside. There we go, that's another Maya Maya, and that will be about number 62, yeah. That's good, then we got all the Maya Mayas in the north and west corner, near the 
skull words and oh uh, skull words that will be in rule, but the last words in high rule. And what was I going to say? No, I forgot what, what I was going to say. And I think I already got that piece of heart I did, yeah, good. So let's go into low rule and get ready for the next dungeon in the game. Which will be... Skull Palace, is it? I'm just looking at the... Uh, it's just been called Skull Woods, but I'm so used to say Skull Palace or something like that. <laughs> so you're in the area where the Skull Woods strike fair into the hearts of the living. So we're gonna find another sage chair, and that is going to be... So you don't really know. Let's go and see what we can find here. There we see a painting. Do you see who that is? That's one of the characters we saw early in the game. Quite early as well. And here you may find a guy. And he is willing to sell something to you if you pay him... Uh, is it 898 rupees or something? No, I don't want to do it. And you cannot cut the price as far as I know about. But whatever you do, don't buy it from him. And there we got one Maya Maya already in uh, the Skull Woods area. So basically, what you want to do now is getting ready for the entrance. And there we go, another Maya Maya saved as well. So we just want to go a bit backwards. I think that's Dragon Snaps. Snap Dragon. Snap Dragon is the name of those guys. When I think about it. Snapdragons, that's the name. And you can hear there's a Maya Maya there. If you have the golden sword, you might just kill this moblin. But you can use the hammer or the the uh, hook shot to get rid of his shield. And there we got another Maya Maya, and that will be number. Let's see. Oops, not there though. That will be number 65. Yay! And we came all the way from the left side, didn't we? Or was it the middle part now? No, it was. So we're gonna save this crying Maya Maya. Number 66. And we're getting quite far now. And this video will be lasting for about 25 minutes. There we go. That's the another water, water wane. Weather wane. <laughs> Not water, but weather wane. And then I will be saving here now and we will go on for part what was it 14, 15, 16 that will be this will be part number 15 <laughs> as I recall. Or oh, wait. I think actually that will be part number 17. Yeah, that will be part number 17 of course. So this is part number 16. Well, I just forgot. So we'll be seeing you in the next part.